I'm Big Coffee, here with my Skyrim OC Mirin, and we'll talk about Valhalla Combats in its current state, version 101. As you hear, it's in early stages, and the author, Dtry, explains on the mod page that more functions are planned. Let's talk about why Valhalla Combat is awesome. The first thing that took my attention was the new blocking feature. It's now possible to, with or without a shield, parry projectiles when successfully parrying with a 0.15 second window. The projectile will fly back to the enemy and damage them. You can even deflect magic spells like this, though your own mana pool will be drained to do so. What I especially like about this feature is the audio and visual cue. When you manage to do a parry, sparks will emit and a special parry sound will play. There's also a perfect block feature, which will stagger your enemy if you time it just right. In addition, you'll recover stamina to the maximum. These new blocking mechanics tie into the new stamina system overhaul seamlessly. So let's talk about the stamina system now. Attacking enemies with light attacks will now recover your stamina unless you miss. Heavy attacks will still drain stamina as usual, so it's important to time it right so to not leave yourself vulnerable, especially if you use mods that make heavy attacks punishing, such as MCO. Another big feature of the stamina system is the faster stamina recovery. Usually, when I play Skyrim with Vanilla's stamina system, I could pull off two power attacks before draining all stamina. Then it recovered extremely slowly, so I had to spam stamina potions every fight. But with Valhalla combat, the stamina is designed to recover much faster. Now we can enjoy more fighting, less potion junkie. Let's also bring up the stun and execution feature. If you have an external mod called True HUD installed, you'll be able to view an additional meter above enemies' heads. That meter is the stun meter. When it depletes to the bottom, they become unable to act and you can execute them as well. Ultimately, this makes defense a viable strategy as you will deplete the enemy's stun gauge by performing timed blocks. However, this strategy works best in melee situations. To further the melee experience, it is also possible to install another mod called Elden Parry. This mod is also made by Dtry and is fully compatible with Valhalla Combat and the stun system. Elden Parry will remove the ability to bash enemies. Instead, you have to bash at the exact moment when they attack, making it a high risk, high reward addition to the combat gameplay loop. Valhalla Combat also comes with tweaks that you can do in-game from the MCM menu and I'll go through my recommended tweaks. Ultimately, from my perspective as a player, this mod is still a work in progress. The uh, stamina debuff system will make it so that when NPCs run out of stamina, they will merely stand still and stare at you. What the hell are you thinking? So, I recommend turning off the stamina debuff until this is addressed. If this only applies to me, please tell me in the comments. I really love blocking and parrying with this mod installed. I find that blocking becomes skill based, while still retaining a feeling of relevance to the RPG formula as you need to have enough magicka if you wish to deflect magic spells, making magicka relevant to warrior classes. Don't forget to comment and like as it helps this channel grow. You can also interact with the screen to watch my previous video. I appreciate it. Thank you.